Hello and welcome to episode 307 of Bobo Scrabati Records. Way. Yes, I thought I'd start off Friday's episode. Last Friday was Bert's, so I thought today we'd start off with the bishop. And uh, yeah, maybe we'll take out the left of FFFFFFFF, seeing as though it's been on sale on the EU servers again, which is really good. If you haven't got one, you should pick one up. They're like one of the best little machines ever. So much fun. So yeah, and maybe if we've got time, we'll go out in the F3 or something as well. So uh, yeah, stock crew and the bishop, we've got as much stuff other than premium consumables that we can take. So uh, yeah, let's go see if we can do really well or really bad. Oh dear. <laughs> Pat was just saying that uh, the bishop was a bit of a joke. <laughs> but I was like, no, you said bishop, we'll go for bishop. So we're on Windstorm, tier 5 match. Hmm. Okay, we're going to have to get kind of forwards a little bit, which is a scary concept. Um, yes, so I'm going to do the risky thing and try and get over... There's a little bit of a mound over this way we might be able to get to, possibly. It's going to be difficult because people are going to have to get quite close. I wonder if we could get up here. Hmm. We can get over most of the town, which is good. No one's really in the middle, which is scary. We have a turret, though, from what I understand. No, we don't. Okay, that could prove that make things difficult. Oh, we got quite a high arc though. Okay, we managed to take a shot. I think that went in. It's good. Should we possibly take another one? Probably should. Let's uh, try and take another one just in case. Okay, there he is. It's uh, really, really close to that hill. That's that's really difficult shot. Covenator, we could have uh, could have had a go at there. Hmm. Okay, there goes the uh, <laughs> T28. Blimey. Okay. So we haven't been spotted yet. Let's. Uh... Cool. We managed to get 50 hit points of damage there. Let's see if we can get another shot on this guy. Nope, he's popped behind a rock. Oh dear. We haven't been spotted yet though, which is good. Maybe we can get a shot on this guy. Haven't played the bishop for ages, feels really weird. That's it. Excellent, we managed to get another one on the Eep. Okay. The uh, enemy artillery have spotted us. Do 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 Bugger. This guy's definitely going to get us. Eep. Come on. Turn. Ah, oh, just not quick enough. Boo. Oh, well. We'll have to see if the uh, the team can pull that one off, eh? Ah. Well, that was a victory, surprisingly. Our team managed to pull it off. So we managed 327 of our own damage and 102 assist. So it's not too bad for not playing the bishop in, like, forever. So, uh, yeah. Pat didn't do too badly as well. 248 damage. So, yeah, there's something. Not too high on the XP table there, but we were kind of midway on the damage table. That's pretty good. So Pat managed three shots fired with two direct hits and no splash damage for those... Uh, for that 248, we managed four shots with two direct hits, two penetrations, and one splash for that damage. So, yeah, not too bad. We did get one on the Stug at the beginning. Awesome. And we got one on the, the little T25, but we didn't manage to finish him off. I didn't actually spot him on the map until it was too late anyway. I don't think I was looking at the map at that point. So we didn't make a loss, though. And that was a times three, so we got just over a 1,000 XP, so that's not too bad. After seeing the little FFFFFFFF, decided that uh, we'll pop out in one now as well. So I've got the Batchap 55 crew in there because I wanted to... Um, try and train them up because obviously we moved their old crew up into the 58 and now we've got this stock crew in a tier 9 which is just scary so uh, yeah let's go have a couple of games in the uh, the left ff 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 ff
We're top tier as well. Blimey, tier 5 game. Jeez, we could be uh, quite devastating. Now, we don't have too much of an issue with its range. It's about 800 metres, I believe, which is similar to the Concord gun carriage. So I'm thinking of actually going to sit over in our normal spot. It's nice because the way tier 5s are, the frontal armour of the left FF is, is pretty good. So if someone comes at us pretty quick, we can uh, defend ourselves quite well, especially from this kind of tier. Only thing is, a lot of these guys move quite fast. <laughs> my reactions aren't, you know, I know I'm only in my 30s, but my reactions aren't quite as good as... Um, they probably should be. So Pat's got the right idea. We're going to go for some crossfire, so we're going to spread out and see what we can uh, we can achieve. I'm going to see if I can get up over to where our little Crusader Four is. If we can, don't want to end up getting spotted though. That's the thing. Oh, it's taking forever, isn't it? Do, 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 do really need it's important to get into a good position first I don't really feel that it's worth us stopping and trying to shoot and things like that and then carrying on to move and then not actually managing to get into the position that we want to get into blah 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 so our M5 should spot the enemy crusader that took out ours hopefully to wait and see do 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 that managed to get to the enemy crusader, which is pretty good. Right, here we go. We'll sit about yeah. We'll get aimed in and whatnot. Wow, there's really not much going on over here, and we are pretty much at our range, so not going to be able to help these guys out very much at all. Okay, well, I have to keep a close eye on, on the map just to make sure we don't get overrun by somebody. Let's see what our Matilda spots. Oh, there's people over here though. Oh, he's down into a position that we can't hit for sure. And we can't hit this position either. Awesome. We do have the chance of getting this guy. Look at that barrel roll. We're quite a way away though. Shot away. Oh, blimey. Jeez. Well, there you go. Don't know if this one will hit. Nope, that was miles off. Okay, let's try and help defend our, uh, our Matilda. We've tracked him. Not too worried about the guys that are with us over our side of the map for the minute. Looks like we've got another one in the Matilda, which is good. I think we should maybe keep trying. Yep, there's another one in. It's nice, we'll keep the, uh, keep the mouse fairly still then. There we go, we managed to get him. Awesome. So the... Uh, the AT was around here, wasn't he? There we go, we've managed to hit him. By me. I wasn't sure that that was going to work. Alright, we'll keep trying then. That probably didn't do any damage then. That definitely went in somebody though. Hmm, weird. Okay, we'll go back to hitting people that we can see. A little bit dodgy. See if that goes in. Nope. Okay. Let's see if we can get aimed in ready for this guy. He's heading up towards Pat, which is not good. We'll take a speculative shot there, just in case. There he is. He's coming up on Pat now. Eep. Eep. Stay alive, Pat. We need to try and keep you alive. Oh, really not doing too well now, are we? Getting those crazy shots in on people and then not. Didn't really lead him enough there either. We might be able to get something in on this T67. 
need to wait for this aim time to come right in though. Ooh, it takes forever, doesn't it? There we go, managed to get that guy. Oh man, really? Now it's just us. That's not very fair. Hmm. Right here then. Probably best for us to try and run. Slowly. We've got two minutes left on the cap, so. Wonder where that little steward is. Not very quick at turning, so. Hmm. Right here then. Keep a close eye. They could end up capping this out. I don't think we could safely get over to the cap if I'm brutally honest. Now I'm willing to just keep going this way, I think. Hmm. We could try and get a speculative shot on the cap, but uh, probably wouldn't be able to. Oh, it's so slow. Would we even be able to get up here? Go, go, go. Six kilometres an hour. Go, 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 go. If Really? Right, we'll try and get behind this little bit of cover. Okay, we've probably been spotted now. Let's just let the same time come right in. There we go. Okay. Issue has seen us. Can he get shot on us? That's the thing. Don't know if he can. He sat very still. He might be sat still. He is sat still. Let's see if we can get another shot on him then. Oh, uh, they've captured. Boo. Well, as you saw, that was a defeat. They managed to cap out. Maybe I could have took some speculative shots on the cap, but, you know, we, we got a little bit of extra damage in. So we did 920 of our own and 106 assist. So that's not too bad for a, for a tier 5. And, you know, that's that's pretty good. So, you know, our WN8 and efficiency were, were way up there. So that's awesome. Top of the damage table. Look at that. 1 and 2 on the damage table. Lovely. So, and on the XP table. Ha! Jeez. Some of these guys didn't even do any damage, so... Yeah, four kills, not too bad. 19 shots fired, 11 direct hits, 9 penetrations and 2 splash damages for our 920 damage. Hmm. That's, uh, that's pretty good. So, just over 17 grand made and 724 XP. It's good. Let's see how Pat did. So he managed 14 shots fired with four direct hits with four penetrations and four splash damages. Four for four for four, four for his 798 hit points of damage. So we got the majority of the kills there as well. Ah, awesome. Okie dokie. Well, I think we'll pop out in it again then. We'll uh, finish this episode off with another left FFFF. Well, look at that. Muravanka. Hmm. Not top tier this time. <laughs> a whole tier below. So, yeah, we're in with a good chance, though. Managed to get some good leading shots on some uh, on some targets, too. Right, we'll head over to the normal spot. I don't think we'll worry too much about crossfire on this map. I think we'll just see if we can uh, get as much damage in as possible together. If uh, Pat marks a target, we'll see if we can try and hit the same target, which would be good. Race. I think we've both got st fairly stock crews in this, if I'm honest. We're winning! We're winning! Go! Go! There's no finish line! I'm going to win! Kind of rock backwards and forwards in your seat. Go! 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 Oh, 25 kilometres an hour there, look. Blimey. Right, I think we'll stop around here. We'll check out the uh, enemy artillery positions. Probably have to move forward slightly. Yes, we will. Okay. Let's keep an eye on what's going on. There's two birds, so they probably won't be sat there. Yeah, balls. If, mm, I suppose if 
the enemy guys had pushed on around this way, I'd probably be sat down around the base of this hill. Hmm, it's going to be more difficult to get the birds. I suppose a good thing is that counter battery from us, our point of view, is kind of out of the question. They're going to have to be very close to us to be able to hit us, which is good. We can uh, keep pounding these guys. See if maybe we can take out the little ones. Shot away. Ooh, very close. Let's see if we can get one more shot on him. Oomph. Ah. Ooh, that's a shame. Okay, might be able to get something on the Covenator. Oh, he stopped. Why did you stop? Boo. Haha, <laughs> looks like Pat's having a go for him too. Okay, there's a 3601H. This is what used to be a uh, medium tank. He stopped as well. That went fairly wide though. Okay, we haven't got long to wait for, uh, for our next shot so we can just keep them firing. Need to try and hit people as much as we can. The uh, eastern side don't look great, do they, at the minute? Oh dear, I think we should try and help out these guys. If we can. This Covenator's going to be running away. Run away! Oh dear. Need to try and get shots on these guys now. One on the KB-1S. It's a decent hit there. I can't believe this Covenant is alive as long as he, he survived as long as he has done. Didn't quite lead him as much as we needed to there. Can we get something on this little ELC? It's difficult to get uh, shots in on these smaller tanks that move quite quickly. See if one of our guys can spot him then. We'll stay aimed in over this way. Looks like our guys are pushing up the north northwest fairly adequately. Which is good. We've got some tank destroyers for protection in our direction. Hmm. Okay, let's uh, try and help out these guys then. And there he goes. Okay, there's one of the birds. Blimey. Take a speculative shot. Oh, that was close. <laughs> Jeez. Okay, get turned again. Let's see if we can get something on this ELC. Let's wait for the same time to come in. Oh, Bert's going in to have a go. Go on, Bert. Go get him. Nicely done. Awesome shotgun there. But it doesn't turn very well now either. Good job, sir. Maybe we could be a little bit brave and move towards some of these enemy tanks slightly. Okay, let's stop and get aimed in then. There's an E2 that's been spotted. Oh, waiting for the same time, that does ruin it, doesn't it? That's tracked him, let's try and get some tracking damage for Pat. Oh, that went over his head. Okay, Pat's managed to get him again. He's just behind the house. That's crap. Okay, let's not worry about him then. Let's see if we can go for this. KV-1S. Whoa! Everybody hit him at once there. Awesome stuff. Cool, the E2's gone. Just a Jackson and the uh, T24. And then a Burt. Where would the Burt be? Could be anywhere. Jackson was last spotted around here in the open. Our guys don't look too willing to... Uh, to move about the place. That's going to cause... a bit of a problem. We're not going to know if we're spotted, are we? Oh well. Let's just risk it. See if we can move up around a little bit. Try not to knock any trees over. 
Okay, there's the bird. And he's running. God, we'll... Imagine getting a shot on a bird. Blimey. If we manage to splash him there, I'll be bloody surprised. Wow, looks like all of our guys are heading over that way. Kind of wish I didn't come over here now. Okay, hmm. well, well, we'll move with them, I guess. Don't want to get caught out by uh, by the Jackson. No idea where that bloody Skoda's gone. Slowly moving through through the village hunting for our next target okay where have they all gone you would have thought the hellcat would have spotted something by now okay there's one of the birds there's the Jackson as well. Nice shot there from the other bird. Okay, let's see if we can get a shot on the Jackson. Well, we might have splashed him. Possibly. Yeah, he's got very little hit points left. And there we go, so it's just the Skoda left. Where would the Skoda be? Okay, there he is. Gonna take a pop shot while we get moved. And there he goes. Yeah, good game. So there we are, that was a victory. Not quite as much damage that time, 640, but we managed to get 607 assists as well. Yeah, not too bad. We didn't get a splash on the little bird in the end. Yeah, that was a long old shot though, wasn't it? So both of us uh, most of the way up the damage table there. The, uh, blimey, our Bert did amazingly well. Look at that, 16 shots fired with 12 direct hits. Blimey, we managed 18 shots fired with 6 direct hits. And uh, Pat there managed 22 shots fired with 4 direct hits. So <laughs> we were firing all over the place. But we made just under 22 grand, and that was a times 3 for the day. So, yeah, good stuff. Awesome. It's a decent amount of XP for our crew as well. Rightio. Well... I'll leave you there for this episode. Thank you for watching. Leave a like and stuff. It really helps me out. Helps the channel and that. And uh, yeah, if you haven't got a left FF, go get one. They're amazing. And uh, if only they had a few more crew member slots, then we could train crews more effectively, eh? Hey, eh, Wargaming, eh? <laughs> cool. Well, I'll see you in the next one. So until then, bye. I'm sweating my nuts off, I don't know about you.